Now to Kobe Bryant, a five-time NBA champ, Academy Award, Award winner, the man behind a best-selling book, and now he's got a new book on the way. Eva Pilgrim sat down with Kobe to talk books, fatherhood, everything under the sun. This was actually a really fun conversation. Kobe Bryant is the dad to four, yes, I said four, daughters. And he told me being a father to girls has definitely changed him. His daughters, his inspiration for his latest book. You know him best as NBA champion and two-time Olympic gold medalist. But Kobe Bryant got creative after his 2016 retirement from basketball, now out with his second novel, Legacy and the Queen. This story about a young tennis prodigy who needs to summon magic to defeat the supernatural is very close to Bryant's heart as a longtime athlete. You know, sports is a very emotional thing. And in our world, that emotion is what creates the magic. Why did you decide to write this book about a girl playing tennis? Well, I have four girls at home. And uh, you know, I want to make sure it's important that they you know, see characters that look like them and that are also athletes. And uh, you know, they get tired of hearing my voice of yeah, be persistent, work hard, you know, believe in yourself. They're kind of like, OK, Dad, all right, I got it. We get it. So when I can put them into stories like this, hopefully we'll get that same message without having their parents in their ear all the time. What is the lesson that you want little girls and little boys to take away when they read this book? The biggest thing for this book and all our books in the series is self-awareness. How to be aware of the anxiety that you may feel, the pressures, whether self-induced or coming from parents or coaches. You know, how to deal with failure, how to deal with success. And unfortunately, we tend to think for our children as content like that is a little too heavy or a little too rich for them at this time. And uh, we disagree. We feel like it's important to have those conversations at an earlier age. Yeah, I mean, now you have a 16-year-old? We have a 16-year-old, yeah. <laughs> That's like dating age. I, I, I don't... That's what they say. <laughs> how is Kobe the dad with the guys coming to the door? Fortunately for me, we haven't really had that happen. Uh, you know, so she's so, keeping it from you. I, I, well, <laughs> hey, let's be real. Listen, I mean, maybe. Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I don't. I don't want to think about you. that. But I, you know, I think that's every father. Yeah, for sure. Stay need, away. Need, stay away. Uh, oh, no, no boys I'm allowed. Kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> well, I but mean, I'm not it's a little though. Little intimidating. I am, but I'm not. <laughs> kind of, but not really. You could feel his energy shift when I start talking about his 16-year-old dating. Gobi's new book is out tomorrow, well, Cecilia. We're looking forward to that. Thanks, Eva. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.